you know, we haven't played in competition for four months now, since October. And so I think, you know, we're going to be a little bit rusty probably. Uh, some of the students did play in some tournaments over the Christmas holidays. But, um, you know, having, for most of the students, though, they have not played since October in a tournament. So uh, just kind of, you know, getting back into the, the competition, into, you know, playing under pressure and that kind of thing. We've had qualifying. We had four rounds of qualifying. So that helped a little bit to, to put some pressure on them. It's going to be a very strong field. Uh, we'll see a lot of the Pac-10 teams, uh, Arizona, Arizona State, uh, UCLA, um, uh, Southern Cal. So it'll be um, it'll be a very, very strong field, probably one of the strongest fields we see this spring. And it's on a golf course that's one of the hardest courses we'll see this spring. So uh, I always feel like it's a good test for us to, to go ahead and play that first because then we know exactly what we need to work on when we get home. And I never have to talk to the students about working on a particular area, particularly short game after being out there because it's uh, it really uh, you know, shows up our strengths as well as some of our weaknesses. So it's a, it's a good start for us. I mean, it's you just go right into it and, and you know, it's sort of baptism by fire kind of thing. But we got to get into it and, and get moving and, and um, you know, start, start the spring strong. Yeah, I'm definitely excited. Uh, it's really fun to go out to L.A. It's a great location um, and it's a really competitive tournament. So we've been working hard coming back from the off season and we're excited to start the season. Well, the qualifying went pretty well, and um, we we varied it a little bit this time and had some match play uh, into it as well as the stroke play. And uh, Sierra Sims won the match play. She played very well. She shot a, a 70 one day over at uh, at, at uh, Old Town, and under some it was cold day, and she made an eagle on a hole, and knocked it in from the fairway. So it was exciting for her. It definitely gives me a lot of confidence. It helps me. Um know that what I did over the off season and in the past few weeks has been paying off so it gives me a lot of confidence to go out there and do well in LA. We'll, we'll get off to maybe a, a pretty good start, I would think, because I know a lot of people have not had um, a lot of time or uh, the conditions have been so bad they haven't been able to play, you know, in the snow that we had last week. But we, we didn't miss a practice. We were out here every day, so that really helped us out a lot. This facility was perfect because it's heated. You know, we could hit outside. We could see the ball flight and see the landing of the ball. We could practice our putting. We could use the track men. Uh, we were able to use, you know, all the technology and all the uh, teaching aids that we normally would use in a regular practice when it's 60 or 80 degrees. So it, it's been perfect for us. It's uh, We really didn't miss a beat the whole time.